Tony Dekana. I'm from Adenko Construction and I'm the regional manager for Adenko Free State. This project was introduced by the university and put out on tender. It's, it's based on a one megawatt uh, system. Uh, we've got uh, 125 uh, kilowatt sun grow inverters in and then we've got a 1680 PV panels installed on the ground pound system. We've installed eight 125 sun grow inverters, uh, which is a total yield of about uh, one megawatt. So we've installed 1,680 biofacial panels, and that amounts to 974 kilowatt in total. The expected site yield of the of the project is about 2.2 to 2.5 gigawatt hours for the year. And we must also keep in mind that we have time of use and uh, winter terrace that's, that's kicking in also later in the year. And we opting to save at about 6.2 to 6.5 million per year. A nice added feature that we add on the structures itself is the logo of the university that was engraved or laser cut on the on the end cap. Then we have an inverter kiosk with a LV uh, section on the one side and a DC section on the other. And then in the same kiosk we mount the inverter SunGrow inverter in the back. Um, we've installed a mini sub with a 11 kV grid, so all the sun grow inverters is feeding back into a combiner kiosk that we have on the side, which is fed with cables into the mini sub, and then uh, we feed back power from the sun grow inverters into the mini sub, back into the 11 kV system. Then typically this is our LV design, which was manufactured by so. All the, the combiner kiosk has been connected to that circuit breaker and on this stage we are having 1450 amps producing on, on this stage. Dengo has also have the intellectual property of the Snyder switch gear which we have altered uh, from a normal ring main unit with, uh, with all the edits on this unit. The system was commissioned about a month back and we've uh, produced 147 megawatt hours up to now. Total revenue on this stage is standing at 308,000 rand for, for this month. Just, just for interest sake, Solar Phase 3 has generated 1.9 gigawatt hours and that was that, that's a cost saving of about 4.1 million rand for the year.